So this is part three of my series on Republican candidates and their positions on immigration. So this is ex-South Carolina governor, Nikki Haley. She wants to be president of the United States and she's from the Republican party. So uh, what are her positions on immigration? I'm gonna tell you so that you can decide how you wanna vote based on information about immigration. And if you're not a voter, you can always share this information with friends and family who are voters and who need to be informed. So let's go. So what does Nikki Haley wish to do when she becomes president? Well, she has said that she wants to make it harder for people who are undocumented to get a job. She wants to make uh, e-verify something that's required. So harder requirements for people to get a job and to make employers have more responsibilities for checking people's paperwork. She wants to deport everybody that's unlawfully present. Uh, I haven't heard of any exceptions. She wants to um, close the border, which they all seem to want to do. And she wants to terminate birthright citizenship. So if your child is born in the United States and Miss Haley has her way, then the child will not automatically be a U.S. citizen. She also wants to re uh, restore an old Trump policy called remain in Mexico. So people that cross the border and have legitimate claims to asylum will be forced to go back to Mexico and wait there while they uh, await their court dates. Uh, the other thing she wants to do uh, is her little catchphrase that she's been using is catch and deport. In other words, she doesn't wanna give people a chance to use the laws that are on the books to apply for asylum if they have a legitimate claim and they're caught at the border. It's just catch, deport. Um, you know, instead of catch and release, which is what they've been saying the US government does, that people are caught at the border, they're released into the United States while they wait for their asylum hearings so that they, they can make their arguments. So these are her positions. She's now gaining a popularity. She's uh, pretty close to Trump in the polls and uh, the elections are coming up in Iowa soon. So please uh, share and like uh, this page if you like being informed about issues having to do with criminal law and immigration and share and like this uh, post about Nikki Haley.